Hey loves, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, I know I haven't vlogged for y'all. I've been going through a lot, but um, we're gonna spread God's word because God always help us. So we're gonna spread His word today, and we're just gonna talk about the goodness of the Lord. So let's see what He has said. That I can't even find my lipstick. Um, my lipstick shop to my lipstick or whatever. I can't find it. So when I find it, I gotta clean off my bed. So when I clean off my bed. I'll be able to look for it, but it says loved one. The choice is simple. Chose life or death. Or, I mean, chose life or chose, yeah, chose life or chose death. Chose to follow me or go your own way. Um, live as though I don't exist. And chose death. Love and obey me and chose life is up to you. So, God is saying here that he's not going to force you to believe in him. He's not going to force you to come to him. He's not going to force you to do anything. If you don't believe in the prayer or prayer, you don't believe it works, and you don't believe God's word, he's not going to force you. But when the time comes that he takes all his children home, and, you know, he takes me because I'm one of his children, but, you know, he takes me home, and, you know, I go to heaven, and when you go to heaven, it's, they say, I don't know, because I've never been there, but people say, like, you're not in no pain. You know how we be crying on earth when we be in pain and stuff like that. It's not no pain in earth. It's not no heartbreaks, no, none of that. You're just always happy, like, so you either go, um, you either go, go somewhere where you're always sad and depressed. You're always happy. There's no hope. There's no love. There's nothing for you there but sadness. Or you rather live a life where you're always happy and you just don't have any bad days at all. Um, I would go with Christ because Christ is there when we're not ourselves, like when we're feeling down and when we just feel, feel like life is hopeless or when we lost the man that we wanted, we, God is there for us. So it's like, you know, whatever we face in life, he's there for us. He know he knows what's going to happen, and he knows what what's going to happen after that. Like, he knows everything. So, it's like, it's nothing that Christ doesn't know. And he always knows. That's why he tells us, you chose to follow me. And when you follow God, he gives you everything you want. Meaning, sometimes you have to wait on stuff, but other, other times, he'll just give it to you. Like, even if you have to wait, he'll still give you what you ask for. It just it just won't be in that time specifically that you pray for it, but he'll give it to you before the day is out. So, you know, God gives you everything. And the devil, I think it's what he's talking about the devil here. Like, the devil, he doesn't give you anything. Because with the devil, he just basically come and take your happiness. And he comes and take and put you in positions like worse than you were ever in. And God doesn't do that. He cares for you when you cry. And I had that moment yesterday and I was just, you know, crying and upset. And I didn't come to YouTube because I'm like, I don't want to bring energy to YouTube. I don't want to do that. So God knew I was hurting. And I never, like I said, I never will come to camera. Well, I'm not gonna say never, but I won't come to camera and be crying and upset because for one, I'm not judging those who do, but for one, it's not like, you know, y'all can come through the camera and hug me. It's not like y'all going to throw some tissue or nothing like that. It's nothing that y'all can do. So God knew that I was down, I was bad, and everything else. He knew how I was feeling mentally. I didn't even have, have to explain, even though I explained to him what was going on. I didn't really have to explain anything for real because he knew that child was hurting. That's why he can't come see about me. So I'm saying this to say that you rather would want God to come see about you, right? When you're going through hard times, because like I said, like I was saying in my videos, people call yourself your friends. They your friends, but are they really your friend? Because a friend is there when you're sad. A friend is there when you're happy. A friend is there when you're mad. A friend is there when you're. Uh, when you lost all your income, when you lost all your money, a friend is still there. That's a right or that's a she gonna be with you to death do y'all part, or he gonna be with you to death do y'all part. Regardless if you have money or you have your life together at all, they're still gonna be there with you. Just like God. When you go through trials and tribulations in your life, God is still there with you. He's fighting with you. The mother, He's fighting for you more than you are fighting for yourself. So he's fighting that battle for you more than you are fighting as yourself. So you think you're fighting through this heartbreak, but it's really God fighting for you. You're not fighting through anything. God is doing all the fighting for you. So 
That's why he tells you to rest. I'm going to go to work and I'm going to handle this. But you got to give it to me. A lot of us, we carry on, you know, our problems. And that's why we're so overwhelmed. That's why we're so stressed out. Because we carry them when we shouldn't have gave it to God. We should have just left it in his hands and been okay with the situation. Like, okay, it's hurting me. It's affecting me that, you know, this person's gone or... This person was treating me wrong, or they said something I didn't like, or the conversation didn't, didn't go as I expected it to go, and I just miss them so much. I just want to make things right, and you not really you trying to figure out how to do it. And God is telling me, why don't you leave it to me? I know that person better than you know them. You know, God knows every last one of us. He know how many hairs we got on our head. He know how many hairs is on my head. And this is my real hair for those who are new to my channel. This is my real hair, so He knows how many. How many hairs are on my head? How many hairs are on your head? He knows everything about you. So he knows what hurts you and what doesn't hurt you. So you want to rather go with Christ because he's going to make sure you're happy. He's not going to let you, you know, sit there and be sad forever. It might seem like that, but he's not like that. And he's not going to let you just sit there and be upset. If he sees an issue that's going on, he's going to make sure. Like, okay, he's, like I always say to y'all, he's always... You know, working stuff out for your good. He always got some plan, you know, that that we don't know. So we don't know what tomorrow holds. We don't know what today holds. But at the end of the day, you have to trust and believe that God is working on your situation. So he knows exactly how, how you're feeling throughout the day. He knows how you're feeling. For me, like, even me giving his word, he know. Like, sometimes, like, I can give his word all the time. And I can still be battling stuff that's going on with me mentally that I don't even shut through to. It's like, he knows. So, it's like, I don't even have to come through camera and be like, okay, I'm dealing with this and dealing with this. Because God already know. Yes, you give my word. I'm proud of her for giving my word out to those who are in need of giving, of receiving my word and getting my word. But, I'm going to have her too in the midst of it. And I'm a double bless her because even though, you know, she's going through what she's going through, she's still delivering my word and... Even, like, when I give her what she wants, she's still going ahead and deliver my word. Like, most of us, most of our con most of us content creators, we need breaks from YouTube. So, it's not nothing personal. It's not, you know, nothing that y'all doing wrong. It's just that we take our many breaks from YouTube. We have to come back and be, like, we have to come back and be, you know, our happy-go-lucky self. We can't just get in front of the camera and be upset. You know, at least for me, I don't. I don't get in front of camera. If I know I'm upset, I'm not getting in front of camera, and I'm not going to, you know, bring that energy to YouTube. But, yeah, going back to what I said, not to get off track or nothing like that, but going back to what I said. Um, so, yeah, that should really get you to choose your life with Jesus. Like, he's giving you the option here. He's saying, do you want to follow me or do you want to follow the devil? Like, and I told y'all, the devil is going to make it seem like he's going to give you whatever you want. The devil talks a good game to you. So, the devil could, will convince you at all times. Like, yeah, I'm going to give you whatever you want. Yeah, I'm going to ask your prayers. Yeah, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. And then when he finally gets you, he don't do none of that. He just make you sadder than what you already was. And he make you hurt than what you, ten times worse, sir. On the other hand, God, when he gives you something, God don't take it back from you unless... You didn't appreciate it or unless you bragged about it so much. But otherwise, other than that, and he he um he disciplines you. So on top of that, like when he takes it from you, but he's still there in your in your space, like he's still there for you. So you know. Um so which one y'all wanna chose? Y'all wanna chose to follow Jesus or y'all wanna follow death? I mean or y'all wanna follow the um devil. It's up to y'all. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope this video hit 1K views. Um, I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Know that God's with you. Know that he loves you. Know that I love you. And like I said, if you're new here, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I have more videos. If you haven't checked those out, I have more videos down at the bottom. Like, I have more content out coming for you guys. Um, and I have more content on the way for you guys, too, on top of that. But, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys this quick, um, YouTube video. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, loves.